the format of being robot. May I ask you a very important question, have you ever come across this in your life? If so, then let me be the first person to tell you that this is the one and only known image of the Nickelodeon Chainsaw logo that was ever seen once on Nickelodeon, but thanks to the controversy of it scaring kids around the country, I can only assume other parts of the world as well. This piece of media is considered lost and would stay lost until further notice, with the only known photo of this logo surfacing a forum page which was where it was originally found. This forum page can no longer be accessed because of financial issues which I won't bring up or go into details as it's irrelevant. The page would talk about shows that people grow up with or still watch to this day and they like to talk about media that was not found but only slightly remembered thanks to a burning memory they had for a long time. This was something known as lost media for those who lived under a rock or had no access to cable or the internet. The people who know about it say that it was one of the pioneers of lost media forum pages which range from either famous lost media or non-famous lost media. One stood out in between. Something that sounds crazy but at the same time, not so far-fetched. Now Nickelodeon is obviously known for making great, if not, the best cartoons ever. They're also known for having a million varieties of logos that Nickelodeon would love to brainstorm and or get creative with these said logos. They range from elephants, frogs, race cars, you name it but it usually sticks to the Splat logo, the most iconic logo for Nickelodeon. One recalled a logo shaped like a chainsaw for Halloween at the end of a Chalk Zone episode in 2002 and that person claims to remember it as if it was yesterday. He was in the living room watching his favorite Nickelodeon shows Home Alone and his favorite episode was coming on but since he didn't have a tape recorder anymore that his parents got rid of to make way for DVD, he had no choice but to record it from his family's camcorder. It was dark in the living room at the time so the screen was visible to where you know it's comprehensible. He claimed that episode gave him a bad feeling despite knowing that the episode was in no way different than any other episode he has seen. He watched as the TV glowed and shined around his face like a fly staring at a UV light trap. It was all fun and games until the end credits came on and rolled through and the company logos played. The infamous chainsaw logo appeared on the screen and if it weren't for the random chainsaw grinding noises in the background, he would have not cared with no further thought. The memory was bouncing around his head like a pinball, so he tried to look it up, everywhere, YouTube, Facebook, 4chan, he even tried googling the image from his camcorder to no avail. It was strange how this one logo that appeared on TV is nowhere around on the internet or even claimed by Nickelodeon, that they've made it themselves, it was like if it didn't happen, but how? When other people on the forum page read his message, they didn't take it seriously and speculated that he made it up for shits and giggles. Jokes and laughter soon turned to paranoia and people freaking out. It came to some of those people's knowledge that they too have seen it before. Some people, in fact, a small majority of people had the same story as he did, most were full of shit and sprinkled their lore and fake story on it just to be popular. There isn't any other way of figuring out this mystery nor analyzing the footage he recorded, that's if he is willing to share the footage.